it's the innovative way of really drawing the kids in, making them want to learn, and it's something that in my 13 years of education I've never seen done before. Our job in the tech department is truly to identify ways to make the lives of our teachers easier and to give them more time back in their day to work with their students. Epic Ed has pulled the best of everything that we were doing and put it all in one place for us. It is 100% Oklahoma academic standards aligned and it's created by Oklahoma certified teachers. And we built that. We continue to improve it every year and it will just continue to get better and better. No other district in the state has that. Epic Ed lets us engage with our students in a way that we have not been able to before. We built these AR worlds, these VR worlds, so it really immerses the student in the learning and keeps them engaged throughout the process. We have gamification embedded all the way across the board, all subjects all grade levels. With everything being built in together, it allows me to focus more on one-on-one -on -one instruction. Automation is really the key to making sure this works. Our student choice, family choice is so important, it's paramount. We're customizing and individualizing a plan for each of our students, potentially more than one curriculum per student. And if you have 30 students on your roster, that's 30 individual plans and customizations. During some of our heavier seasons, of processing applications, there's hundreds that are being processed a day without anyone knowing this is happening. It's, it's happening in the background. When we first uh, went over to our new platform, there was a lot of importing of grades that we had to do manually. And we said, we need help. It's so much easier now. I can spend more time teaching, less time typing up assignments. Automation gets the technology depersonalization out of the way. It allows them to connect a lot more quickly. Which allows me to do what I like, working with my kids one-on-one. -on -one.